winning world titles is important to me, but what motivates me is trying to do something that no one's ever done before. And that has always been the motivation in the run, to try and run faster, you know, run faster than, than anyone. And then the next year I ran faster than the year before, and always having that goal, the vision that I always use that's really powerful for me is that finish line in Kona. I think about it in training, I, I think about it in hard sessions, in easy sessions, and that one vision running down a Lee Drive for me is enough to want to get out of bed and do the work. You just got to be consistent in the training. It's not about like knocking it out of the park every single session. It's about turning up every single day, doing the work. It's repeating, repeating, repeating. And there's the thought of, oh, it'd be nice to stay in bed, but it's never going to happen because I know that in order to achieve my goals um, that I've set for myself, I need to get out and get the work done. And those Ks in the pool and the bike and the run are not going to do themselves. There's kind of a medium level of fatigue that you kind of roll with for most of the year. Some days you might feel a little better. It's almost like everything's clicking. You're doing good time, you're putting out good watts, things are connected, you feel strong. It's just flowing, everything feels great. And those days are few and far between. Finding success is about stringing together as many sessions, but also quality sessions as you can. And so recovery becomes a really important component. I think the better you can recover from a session, the more likely you are to nail next day's session or the afternoon session. If there's something in life you want to accomplish, then you can find a way to get there. And I think that's something that triathlon's really taught me because who am I to be a world champion? I'm no different than anyone else. And sure, I you know, have a natural ability to run well, but it didn't just come. I had to do the work and I've been doing the work for 15 years and yeah, I have a couple of world titles to show for it, but there's no reason this, this could have been someone else easily. This year I feel excited to go back to Kona. I'm just trying to focus on what I can do and if I can deliver the performance I think I'm capable of, then I think it'll be a good day.